There is a lot of hypocrisy. There's a lot of uh, times where you're going to look at a Christian and be like, my goodness, why are they behaving that way? That's because you've taken your eyes off of God, off of Jesus, and you're focusing on man. Man's always going to disappoint. Man is not God. So instead of looking to fallen human beings to understand what the Messiah is, why not look to the Messiah? I don't get this with these atheists. Why are you looking to modern day churches? Don't you know that's part of the deception? Don't you know there's people, televangelists, that go on television and they take on the, the appearance of being a Christian, but that's only to deceive you? They're a wolf in sheep's clothing and it's effective. Look at the operation of deception that these wolf in sheep's clothing are doing and how effective it is to deceive people like Onision. Onision sees the wolves and goes, well, you know what? All Christians are bad. It's like, imagine I was a, 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 in a gang, right? I was a crip. Well, all of a sudden, I decide I want to create some trouble for the blood. So I go and put the red bandana on, and I go around and I start doing crazy stuff with the red bandana on. Now, people from the outside look at me, and they identify the red bandana, and they're like, oh, look at the bloods. The bloods are horrible. Was it ever the bloods? Did the bloods have anything to do with it? Or were you just a fool that got deceived by a very deceptive tactic? That's exactly what this is. They're being deceived by a very deceptive tactic that Jesus warned about. He told you this would happen, but they don't want to go to the words of Jesus and the warnings. They want to make up their own little fairy tales about what the Bible teaches and create their own little star, their doctrines and straw mans, which aren't even based in scripture because they can't actually go after the word of God. They really can't. <laughs> <laughs> Sipping wine, breaking bread for If you're scared, go to church